This is driving around in circles really, really fast. Buckle up, Barry. Here we go. Billy, what are you doing? Get back in the car. Oh, my God. That's it. I've been thinking about leaving. You can't leave. We're a team. Teammates look out for each other. We got a sweet here, Luce. It doesn't get any better than this. I want more. So it's lovely to have you guys here for the release of Spin Out. Um, and I just really would like to ask you guys, what attracted you to the roles of your characters in this film? Um, well, I like, I like that Lucy is um, kind of... A, a, she's a great female character and um, I think her relationship with Billy is... It's cool, they're kind of on a level playing field and the chance to work with Tim Ferguson and the dialogue that him and Edwina wrote was pretty hilarious to read and, um... It's not yeah. a typical relationship no. either, you know, it's not like, um... <clears throat> the usual kind of uh, on-screen couple, you know, in a, mm. a rom-com, like, they're both kind of um, one-upping each other yeah. and there's a kind of competitive um, aspect to their relationship um, and then they're sort of trying to deny the feelings that they mm. have for each other, so... Yeah. That's, that's, you know, kind of fun material to, to work with. Mm. And awesome. Yeah. Um, so what makes Spin Out such a genuine Aussie film? I think, um, I don't know. Well, well, I, guess I think it's, a, it's kind of like a shedding light on a whole massive part of Australian culture that we really don't see that much in, yeah. well, at least mainstream. Um, yeah, just the fact out. that it's said it would be an Espo, you know, yeah. like that's um, such a kind of... Um, inherent part of Australian culture, you know, especially out in, in the country. So it's kind of cool to see it um, put up on screen. And had you guys ever attended a Bachelors and Spencers Bowl before? We didn't, no. 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 So, no. So, <laughs> so what was it like for you guys to really get in there and give it all your best? Um, it was... Well, we shot the film in Shepparton out in, in the country and met a lot of the locals out there and, and they're a big part of the film and, and um, you know, kind of... If it wasn't for them, then it wouldn't kind of have have this as an authentic mm. a vibe as it does. Mm. And so we just enjoyed meeting and hanging out with everyone and trying to, you know, um, represent it in a in a fun way and not a way that sort of uh, patronises mm. that element of, of Australian culture. So that kind of celebrates it. Yeah. How did you guys go with all the stunts in the in the film as well? Did you enjoy kind of driving the Utes and everything like that? Yeah. I mean, in, in the beginning, it was slightly daunting just the idea of you know, drifting a car quite fast. Yeah. <laughs> um, but it, once you kind of get the hang of it and you feel comfortable and, I mean, we had a really good team of people that were teaching us and we were always very, um, it was a, you know, controlled environment. Yeah. I think um, at first we were like, oh God, this is really intimidating because yeah. the cars are so powerful and, you know, um, you sort of get worried if, you know, if hopefully it's going to work out. Mm. And then I think by the end of it, we were like, we were like oh yeah, we get to do it, let's do it again, let's go again, yeah. you know. And so it, it's a kind of, um, it's a contagious, you know, yeah, you just sort of want to, you just want to do burnouts. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Just, awesome. Yeah. Um, so did you guys have a favourite scene in the film as well? Favourite scene? I think, I don't know, there's, there's a couple of scenes in the film that I really like, but there's one scene that Morgan and I have which is quite long and shot in one take and, mm. and um, there's just a lot of, uh, I guess because we watched a lot of the screwball uh, romance comedies like His Girl Friday and the fact that they play in one take and stuff like that. So, Yeah, yeah the dynamic of the relationship really kind yeah. of... Yeah, we really play with that in that scene. It was, yeah. it was fun to do. Awesome. And then I jump out of a moving car. I'm yeah, pretty he just casually jumped out of What can you love about that? <laughs> <laughs> so finally, guys, what can audiences expect when they view Spin Out in Australian cinemas on September 15? Um, well... Fast cars. Fast cars. Just people... Parties. Parties and mud fights and... Pashing people and you know just regular. <laughs> Is it Friday somewhat night. the Aussie <laughs> Fast and the Furious in a way? I mean, there's a bit. There's a, obviously the cars are a big element of it, but um, there's yeah. real. There's like, no there's heist. Real, We're not, we don't. There's kind no of, heist. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. There's, there's real stories, yeah. and it's all very relatable. I mean, all the characters are um, are really interesting and funny in their own way, but um, there's some. Yeah, there's there's real kind of experiences and that are all very universal. I think it's not just about cars in the country. Yeah. You know? I loved how the movie showed um, all these range of characters. It, w it was just 
great to see like a different variety mm. of people um, and it kind of gave that authentic vibe to the whole movie and I really enjoyed it. Cool. cool. Thank, Thank you so you. much guys. Thanks a lot. Thank you for your time. Nice. Are we setting each other up for what? Give me the legs and lips and the blue dress. She's out of your leg. Lots of guys here tonight, you're feeling lucky. Oh shit. Hell no. Wait, Lucy! It's the world's best day with me! I don't know what life will be like without you. And stay. Hey, Mary, just wanted to grab your advice on something. My advice? Well, if you keep your hands off it, the rash should clear up in no time. <laughs> <laughs>